This is the Martini Mortgage Podcast with Kevin Martini. Hello and thank you for tuning in and let me dive right in right away. Here is the question I want to ask you. Do you have any interest in how your monthly housing costs can increase your family wealth? I would imagine the answer is yes. In the Martini family, owning a home has been a great way to build family wealth. With home ownership, your monthly housing costs can increase your family's wealth. I believe from the bottom of my belly that home ownership is on the path to wealth. I also know there are five financial reasons or benefits, if you'd rather, to buy a home and have a mortgage. So let me break these five Kevin Martini style. Hashtag Kevin Martini Live number one is leverage. With leverage, one can increase their real estate net worth. In the simplest form, leverage is where you borrow money to increase your potential return on an investment. Oh, by the way, I'm the guy that helps you borrow money in the form of a mortgage. Let me share a quick example for illustration only. Let's assume that you purchased a home in Raleigh for $500,000. Let us assume that you are putting 20% down on the home purchase. Now listen, I feel it very important for me to go ahead and reiterate that this is just an example and I'm using 20% down just for illustration only. And so we can do mental math real quick. You see, you do not need 20% down to buy a home today. The median down payment on loans approved in 2018 was, wait for it, 5%. With the Martini Mortgage Group at Benchmark Mortgage, every day we have programs that require just 3% down. And there are programs that we offer that have no down payment requirement and down payment assistance. Let me say it one more time. You do not need 20% to buy a home. So with that said, let me get back to the example. You are buying a $500,000 home and putting 20% down. And that 20% is $100,000. Now the 80% of the purchase is what I call OPM. OPM is an acronym for other people's money. Yep, a mortgage is OPM. Every day, I help people secure people's money in the form of a mortgage, and I truly believe that a mortgage is an amazing thing. Now, let us assume that upon purchase at home on January 1st, and let us fast forward to December 31st of the same year. Now, for conversation purposes, let us assume that the home values went up 5% during the first year of ownership. So, your $500,000 home is now worth $525,000. Are you tracking? Hence, your net worth increased to $525,000. Furthermore, because of leverage, you have made 25% return on your cash. As a refresher, you put $100,000 down and the home appreciated 5%, which in this example was $25,000. Yep, that is 25%. So you put $100,000 cash on cash return. It is now worth one twenty-five. dollars Now, let me compare and contrast. Let's assume that you did not buy a $500,000 home and you decided just to buy a home equal in value to the $100,000 of cash you have. So you have purchased that $100,000 home for cash. And let's just say on January 1st, so we stay consistent, let us assume that the first year's appreciation, just like the example above, that home appreciated at 5%, just like the first example again, that would mean that you would have a net worth of $105,000. And your cash on cash return is only 5%. In the first example, you made $25,000. In the second example, you made $5,000.
The difference between these two values is $20,000. This $20,000 is the example of what leverage can do to help build family wealth. This is just one way you can make your monthly housing payments work for you. Leverage allows one to amplify and multiply the returns using other people's money. Now, hashtag Kevin Martini Live number two financial reason to buy a home. This is going to blow your mind and is crazy, insane, simple to understand and comprehend. So it's very obvious. However, many folks miss this one. Some people are afraid to take on the obligation of a mortgage because they're afraid of making a mortgage payment. Here is a newsflash. You are paying for housing whether you own or rent. Here is a fact. When you rent, you are paying for a mortgage. You are not just paying your rent. You are paying your landlord's mortgage for them. Right now, I mean today, many loans are approved with the Martini Mortgage Group at Benchmark Mortgage with a low down payment and even with someone that has a bump or a bruise on their credit. In addition, it does not matter if you are working with me or Logan or Brad. We all offer, as your mortgage strategist, a no down payment option uh, to include the rural development home loan, which is also known as the USDA loan. I have firsthand confirmation that bad things happen to good people. That is why I proudly offer a special FHA home loan program to families that have had a hiccup. I have personally helped families when their credit score was as low as 580. The Martini Mortgage Group also offers community lending solutions via Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac. Home Ready and Home Possible are two very amazing programs with a low down payment requirements and subsidized mortgage insurance. When I say low, I mean only 3%. This is 2% below the medium down payment on loans approved in 2018. Hashtag Kevin Martini Live number three is for savings. Every month when you write the check for your mortgage, you are not only paying the interest, you are also paying principal. When you pay principal, you are reducing the amount you owe. Now, let me go ahead and illustrate. If you purchased a $500,000 home and you put 20% down, and for example, let's assume a 4% interest rate for a 30-year fix, just like the example we talked about earlier when we were discussing that housing is one of the only leveraged investments still available today. In this example, your principal and interest would be $1,909.66 a month. Every month when you make a mortgage payment, you are retiring your debt every month. In this example, you are making a forced savings deposit of $576.33 a month. Listen, in this example, quite simply, you are making a forced savings deposit of $6,915.96 a year. Again, every year you're making a forced savings deposit close to $7,000. If you're renting today, you're making a savings deposit for your landlord. Hashtag Kevin Martini Live number four financial reasons to buy a home is tax. There may be substantial tax benefits to owning a home and having a mortgage. In addition to the mortgage interest, there may be the ability to write off SALT. SALT is an acronym for state and local taxes. A unique financial reason to buying a home is if you itemize your taxes, you may be able to deduct the mortgage interest you pay, assuming you are in a 28% tax bracket. And for illustration only, this would mean that the monthly tax benefit for a $500,000 home we have been discussing would be 
$373.33 a month. Yes, the tax benefit would be $373.33 a month. The annual tax benefit would be about $4,500, actually $4,479.96. When you rent, there is no tax benefits nor ability to write off your rent on your federal or state taxes. However, do not fret. Your landlord most likely will get this benefit, and I'm sure your landlord is thankful for you participating to their forced savings account. Finally, number five, hashtag Kevin Martini Live. Financial reason to buy a home is inflation. Let me define what inflation is. Inflation is a general increase in the prices and a fall in purchasing value of money. Owning a home is typically a hedge against inflation. Housing costs and rents have tended over most periods of time to go up higher than the rate of inflation. And for this reason, owning a home is an attractive proposition because it provides a hedge against inflation. I have found there is a correlation between inflation and home prices. Right now, inflation is tame. However, it may not be that way forever. Right now, home loan rates are still in historic territories. However, they may not be forever. Rising interest rates generally happen when inflation rears its ugly head. Let me illustrate. From April 1999 to May 2000, mortgage rates moved from 6.92% to 8.52%. During that same period of time, home prices went up 10.9%. Historically, when mortgage rates increase, history has shown that prices appreciate and do not depreciate during the same time span. In closing, leverage allows you to use other people's money in the form of a mortgage to amplify and multiply your net worth. And cash on cash return is maximized. Also, keep on the radar that when you rent, you are not paying, you are paying for a mortgage. You are just paying your landlord's mortgage for them. Home ownership with a mortgage provides a forced savings and there may be tax benefits to having a mortgage too. Plus, home ownership is a hedge against inflation. So, if you ask if home ownership is right for you and your family, if you ask me that, I would share I do not know. What I do know, there are many benefits to home ownership, but I do not know your unique situation. I also know that one should work with an experienced local trusted mortgage strategist because the first step is loan and the second step is home. Every day I help home buyers enter the market. Some are first time home buyers and some are seasoned pros purchasing their third or fifth or seventh home and are moving up or down. If you want to have a confidential conversation in a stress-free environment that is judgment-free, and if you want some trusted advice, I am here. Just give me a call or call Logan or call Brad. Give them us, us a jingle at 919-238-4934. My name is Kevin Martini, and thank you for tuning in to the Martini Mortgage Podcast. I'm not just the host of the Martini Mortgage Podcast. I am the branch manager and senior mortgage strategist at the Martini Mortgage Group at Benchmark Mortgage. And you can reach me at 919-238-4934. Cheers. The Martini Mortgage Group makes real estate dreams a reality with trusted advice in a stress-free environment with great rates and on-time closings while providing a world-class experience. If you or someone you know has questions about the current mortgage rates or the current mortgage programs, please reach out to the Martini Mortgage Group at 919-238-4934.
The information contained in this podcast presentation is for general product information purposes only. Arklatex Financial Services, LLC, and MLS number 2143, doing business as Benchmark Mortgage, makes no representations or warranties of any kind expressed or implied about the completeness, reliability, suitability, or availability with the respect to the information, products, or services. All loans subject to borrower qualifying. Other restrictions may apply. Branch Manager Kevin Martini, NMLS number 143962. Branch located at 5650 Six Forks Road. Suite 101, Raleigh, North Carolina, 27609. Contact the branch by calling 919-238-4934. Equal housing opportunity.